Hello everyone, we're back with a more American Truck Simulator. We are t in the Western Star 57X today with a customized reefer. This is my own truck and my own trailer. The last two videos we did quick jobs, today we're doing cargo market. So I own this Western Star and I also own the trailer. So we made it black, we have the exclusive tail lights, we've got the side skirts. And we have the chrome refrigeration unit right there you can see uh, nice matching truck all black nothing crazy nothing fancy looks good looks ready to go we have toys loaded up here we're going to amarillo amarillo, amarillo whatever uh, texas we're currently in clovis um, new mexico just a short of two hour drive and uh, we got our nice navigation here and we're gonna hit the road. Oh, that's not how you do it. That's that was the wrong button. All right, here we go. We're at Walbert and head to Amarillo. I really like this truck because the navigation is super easy to see. I don't need to pull up F3. The mirrors are pretty good as well. That was a kind of a terrible turn we just did, but whatever. Um. We're not going to be following the laws unless we absolutely have to. The last video got a good amount of views, so um, I assume that means people enjoyed me being reckless. We got a green light there, so we didn't have to break any laws. But yeah, I'm just kind of going to be reckless just like I was in the last video. Um, maybe not as crazy, but look, no, I'm not even using a signal right now. Oh, tight one. That's a tight one. Oh, this is going to be a good video. It's going to be a good trip. Short blow down to up to Amarillo. Amarillo. That's all right. I say it because it's like a Spanish word and two L's is a Y sound in Spanish. I'm so used to saying it that way. Look at our 57X here. Beautiful truck. Beautiful truck. We can put the window down too. I set a hotkey for that. I didn't set one for this window, but I don't really need to because this is my side. I don't care about that side. But yeah, and now if I. You can hear the horn a lot better when the window's down. Yeah, the mirrors on this truck are pretty decent. The navigation is really nice. It's actually bigger on the 49X, but the info display here is better than the 49x 49x is a little more uh, outdated this one's more modern also it has a super identical um, navigation and information screen to the cascadia whoops almost missed that turn oh look a moving truck oh it's a risky one it's a risky move Let's turn our flashers on we're being a jerk but at least we're trying to be safe a little bit Still not using our signal because that's for chumps. A lot of traffic here today in Clovis. Look at that. Beautiful truck and trailer here today. Got that nice shiny chrome refrigeration unit. Got some trucks here at this facility. Actually, I'm going to go ahead and put up the window because it is a little bit loud. They did a really good job of uh, emulating that realism in um, in the game of the sound difference with the window down and the window up. I'm actually very impressed with that sound design. Very, very realistic there. Yeah, short drive up to Amarillo, and uh, that'll be it for the for the trip today. Delivering yogurt, that is our load. How much does it weigh? 42,500 pounds. That's a lot of yogurt. There's our beautiful truck. I don't plan on having any accidents on purpose. Uh, I might do one at the end just for fun, just to be silly, but I'm gonna try not to crash. My truck is already damaged. It has 19, wow, that's a lot of damage. Look at that. That's a lot of damage. 19%. Oh, I've done much worse, but uh, that was from a load I did before 
this video and I never got it fixed. I never went to the repair shop. Before I started the video, I was like, uh, should I get it repaired? But ultimately I decided against it because 19%, it's a lot, but it's not enough to be detrimental. So, and it's a short load, so it's not a huge deal. If it was like a six, seven, eight hour load, I would definitely have fixed it before. Look, there's the train tracks, very nice. And also what's good about the 57X and 49X, they're not loud. They're not silent, but they're not as loud as like the Peterbilts or even the Kenworths. The next video I do, I might show off a modded truck. I almost did that with this truck, uh, this video, but I wanted to wait a little bit and cycle through some of the uh, base game trucks. Oh, out of DF it looks like. Oh well. I don't care about that. I think that's something they just added in a small update a couple weeks ago. Um, they call it AdBlue in this game, but that's just DEF, diesel exhaust fluid. Um, that was not a thing up until a couple weeks ago. So that's, that's a nice realistic touch. It's a nice thing to add. Got an infinity there. Oh yeah, uh, I added one of Jazzy Cat's traffic packs. I already had the truck pack, but I just added the car pack. It adds a lot of cars. I think 344 to be exact. Different types of new cars that are not in the base game. So that is very cool. Very cool stuff. Uh, that Infinity, I'm pretty sure, was one of them. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. No, 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 no. No, no. Oh, that's not good. You know what? Well, uh, that's unfortunate. Oh man, that is, that's unfortunate. How far away are we from our destination? Oh wow, look at that. It got us super close. We're only 14 minutes now, that's awesome. I was so worried that it was gonna be push us back I thought I was gonna say like three hours four hours um, but wow oh is that a fire state no that's a truck headquarters wow we got really lucky on that and we still have four hours to get it done we're low on our uh, DEF but that's okay that was crazy I did not mean to flip the truck that's definitely gonna be our uh, thumbnail for the video Wow well I know what the main point of today's video is. Flipped our truck. Not clickbait. I'm just kidding. Got a water tower in the distance. So I think a lot of these cars we're seeing right now are part of that truck uh, car pack. The way you can tell is if it's ha if it has the real logo or not. The base cars in SCS, uh, ATS, SCS software, because of copyright, they're not allowed to have the real logos, but the mods, the modder, the modder that made the car pack, he's not selling it for a profit. The mod was free, so that doesn't cause any copyright issues. So the ones with the real logo, like the Infinity we saw earlier, are from his mod. I'm pretty sure that's the way it goes. Because I don't think any of the cars in the base game have real logos. The trucks do, because they have licenses with all the truck manufacturers. Oh no, oh wow, that was bad. That was a bad turn. And our spot is gonna be around the corner. Overall, it's a good trip besides the flipping on our side, but hey, it is what it is. It's a very beautiful truck. I really like it. Where is our spot? It's around the back. There it is. It's a tight one. It's kind of a tight. Let's see if we can line it up first try. Oh, that's not lined up at all. Look at our trailer. It's all messed up. 
come on, come on, come on. Will it give it to us? Yeah, there we go. Where are we? What is this? Go, oh, it's a grocery store, which makes sense because it's yogurt. Got some trailers over there. And yeah, I have it set on safe parking just because it's quicker. Um, yeah, look at this beautiful truck. We are ready to unload. We got the pallet jack right there. Very nice, very nice. All right, we'll go ahead and press enter, get this done. Yeah, that time was all messed up because we had to get towed to the service, so that's not accurate. The real load itself was only like two hours, just short of two hours. But uh, no damage penalty. Made 6,300 little XP. I knew it was going to be a short load, but um, yeah. That's all for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to see more, let me know. Leave a like and more ATS to come. See you later.